In this video, we will show you how to use a webcam or video files to do motion capture and animate VRM characters in Unreal Engine. On the Dollars Mocap website, download the main program, the Unreal Engine plugin of your engine version and the control rig for UE4 Mannequin. And we will also need VRM for you, you can download it here. We will use this VRM file in our project, you can find all the links in the description. Here we have a blank UE project, let's create a plugins folder. And copy the VRM for you plugin into it. Then the dollars mocap plugin. And we will copy the content folder of the plugin into the content folder of our project. Finally, let's copy the control rig of mannequin into our project. Now we can launch the project. We will enable the plugins first. VRM for you. OSC. Control rig. Now let's start the project again. When the project is loaded, let's create a new folder named VRM and drag a VRM file into it. The VRM file is imported, let's save the files. Now let's find the skeletal mesh file, and create a control rig for it. And we will open the UE4 mannequin control rig. and copy the nodes in the control section into our control rig. And also the nodes in the ADJ section. Now let's save and compile the file. Then we will need to copy the variables in the My Blueprint tab. Let's rearrange the windows first. Note, if you don't have the My Blueprint tab, you may open it in the window menu. Now let's copy the variables. Okay, all the variables are copied. Then we will need to copy the whole control rig graph into our control rig file. Let's copy the upper half first. Then the lower half. and we connect the two halves. Okay, we don't need the UE4 mannequin control rig anymore, let's close it. Now we need to fill the variables with the bones names of the VRM skeletal mesh. Let's open the skeletal mesh and copy the name of the hip bone and paste it into here. We will do this step for all bone variables.
You may notice as we fill the variables, the pose of the character has changed, we will deal with this later. We are almost done. Now let's reset the rotation values in the offset transform of the nodes in the ADJ section. The character turns back to T-Pose as we reset the values. Okay, that's all for the control rig file. Now let's select the skeletal mesh, and create an animation blueprint. And we will open the animation blueprint of the UE4 mannequin. First we will copy the variables from the UE4 mannequin anim blueprint to our animation blueprint. Then we will copy the event graph. Finally we will copy the anim graph. And select the control rig we have made in the control rig node. The last thing we need is a blueprint class, let's make a new one. We will pick bp underscore dollars mo cap actor as the parent class. Open the blueprint, add the skeletal mesh of the VRM. And select our animation blueprint in the anim class. Now let's drag the blueprint into the scene. And also drag the dollars receiver in the dollars folder into the scene. Select the VRM Blueprint class, and select the Dollars Receiver in the Scene in the Details view. Start the project, and open the Dollars Mocap main program, you can animate the VRM character in real time now.
We missed physics simulation before, let's add it.